You know what time it is. Two Nation, what's going on? It's your boy, Big Vic, the bearded brother. What's going on? So, welcome back, damn it. So, I follow Josh Ezra on LinkedIn. And I just happened to go to LinkedIn. You see, there was crack lacking. New product alert. I'm like, oh, it's dropped. I've been waiting on the Cut Buddy successor for quite some time because since the original Cut Buddy dropped, a lot of beer tools came on the scene trying to edge the way to the market. Some did good, some did bad. You guys can see them on my channel The Beard Ninja, Aberlite Beard Tool, Vegan's Beard, uh, Exec Beard. I, I, a ton of, I've ton of, tried a ton of beer tools and the cut buddy for the longest didn't have any real competition but then got swept when the Everlight beer tool came in because this thing is freaking huge man look at this look at this look it's a big big beer tool and so, that was my only gripe, because I was a lot heavier than I was now. So, trying to put the little tool and then do it, and I didn't have, you know, pencils or nothing like that to do all that. <sighs> New one dropped. It's called the Cut Buddy Plus. And it's pretty big. So, let's whip this out the package. Got the little knots right there. You know what I'm saying? They got that branded logo, the little cut buddy guy. You see the eyes in that joint, bro. Look at that, man. Let's, let's get that focus real quick. Yeah, man. So we got a full on beer tool. Yes. All my life. I just wanted a bigger beard too. This one looks right, and it fits my entire. And it's still somewhat flexible, not not as flexible as the last one. But uh, what they did is it looked like they streamlined the design with less moving parts, probably for cost efficiency. But yeah, man, you still got the for people who still have hair. Still do you, you see curve. You know what? Let's go grab the original cut buddy. Put them side to side. Boom! Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. So as you can see, they added a little cone feature. They took away this little divot, this little notch right here. No, it's a little divot, like a little, you want to hit the little corner. They took that away, but this, I didn't realize the, this is where the logo came from. They just kind of redid it. So they got that, they supersized it. And here we are, man. Look at this. Look at this. Is that the same size? And you got more. Measurement notches or ticks right here on the edge. Let's see if we can get that. Should be able to see that. So, you got more of that, man. And I'm just, yeah, I'm, I'm feeling it. Like I said, not as flexible, not as easily bendable. But you can see this has multiple moving parts. This can eventually come loose. It hasn't. I purchased this when I first learned about the cut button. I think, like, literally the first year they dropped these. I'm gonna say three, maybe four years ago. I'll throw the link, I'll throw the video up. I'll throw a link in the description to this. But man, y'all already know. Y'all already know what time it is, man. Y'all already know I'm gonna get you. Lining up the beard. Man, well, look at that. I mean, look at that. The perfect curve, like just one. 
which is an issue, you know, other barbers have you because you you start here, then you got to move up, and then you could lose. But look, man, look at that. And I'm fat, so I'm bad. Let's say I'm going to come right here to the corner of my lip. Oh. There we go. So you come into the corner of the lip, bam, right there. I can try to curve in. Boom, boom. And so, yeah, man, that's dope. So let me show you what else came in the box. I ordered a four pack of these. These little barber pencils, uh, eyeliner. But I'm using this barber pencil to help draw the line in. That way, you can get the line perfect on each side. So your beard won't be perfectly curved, but on one side it's curved right about here. It's like starts with the lip, but then it curves just a little bit lower and it comes up and then you're trying to fix it and you're gonna push your beard line down. Need these. But this came in for free. Inferno Soft Brush. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't add this to my order, so this is actually dope. Uh, damn. For size comparison. Hey guys, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. Until next time, peace and blessings. I might be down the block. I say.